Hey guys, it's me, Melissa, and welcome back to my channel. Today we got a little bit of a special vulva haul. Today is the Black Friday vulva haul. So if you guys don't know what happened during Black Friday, actually it was all day Friday, all day Saturday, all day Sunday, and like Monday in the morning. They were giving out like coupons for $5 free. Free. Like no limited amount you needed to get, just a $5 coupon. And they were doing this every hour on the hour. Now, I didn't find this out until like half the day through Friday. And then I didn't realize it was like super quick. You had to be super, super quick. It almost kind of reminded me of like the Daily Wish giveaway because they only had, I think, like 300 coupons per hour. And they were gone in like three seconds. <laughs> so it was like really, really stressful. But I think I claimed like 13 of them. So we got like 27 items here. I believe in between like 12 and 13 orders and so you got to figure every single one of these things I got for free now a few items didn't arrive but that's gonna happen maybe it'll show up later but I waited to the date they didn't come so I figure I'll just show you guys what I got now when I say free I will let you know that they make you pay two cents per order when you do anything free so big deal I paid two cents and got you know 498 for free now with these items my goal was to try to get as close to five dollars as possible so you got the full coupon like use so some things I ordered maybe I wouldn't have normally ordered or it was just kind of like a random thing because the goal was to get as close as I could and it's hard to find things adding up exactly to five dollars or you, you even could have spent five dollars and two cents and still only get charged two cents so my goal was to get as close as I could to five dollars and two cents now this is also going to be a collab with Becca on a budget because I told Becca about it and she claimed a few of them also so then you can hop on over after you finish this video and go see kind of what she got during her Black Friday coupon bonanza. But it was pretty sweet. Now, they must have lost a lot of money because you figure if they were doing 300 coupons per hour for three full days and then some, that's a lot of lost money. Now, whether they'll do it again this year, I don't know. But at least this year, if they do it again, I'll be more prepared. I'll know how to do it. I'll know how to like refresh and hopefully I'll claim even more. It was pretty exciting. Free? You really can't be free. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's just take a look. Some of these items, I did call my mom. I was like, anything you want, I'm getting it for free right now. So some of these things my mom wanted. And then I got a few things for my dad. And then I got just a few random stuff. We'll see. Alright, so this one would have been $1.37. Now this is something that I would never have paid $1.37 for. It's just like a bathroom cup. My bathroom cup I have right now is like red with like hearts on it and I kind of wanted a new one so if I can get it for free. I mean I don't think I would pay $1.37 for this. You can get something at the Dollar Tree for a dollar or maybe we'll get like multi cups like this for a dollar but since I was getting it for free I really didn't care and I wanted one. So this would be a perfect little bathroom cup. Not like the most sturdiest plastic you've ever seen in your life but it'll do the job. And yet again free. All right, what else? We got a lot, so it's probably gonna be a long video. Buckle down. All right, so this one, I got this for my dad, and it was $3.21. And I called it, like, a thin watch. Because <laughs> it's, like, a little bit thinner. As you know, my dad loves watches and just switched them out, watches and rings. So I figured this is something a little bit different, even though it is kind of, like, just a regular watch with watch band. It is, like... Thin. Thinner than most watches. I mean, it seems nice to me. It has that little thing in here, which I'm going to leave in to keep it so it's not on, so you don't waste any of the battery. A lot of the watches will come, like, with that, which I'm very happy about, because who knows how long they've had these watches. So if they were running when you got them, you won't really know how long you're going to get with them. Plus, like, watch batteries, some of this can be more expensive than what you actually even paid for the watch. So I hope he likes this. The band's decent. It's not, obviously, the best quality you've ever seen in like leather who knows it if is even leather but it has a little like kink in here from when it was like in the packaging but I think you'll like it especially knowing that I got it for free even if he wears it a couple times I don't care <laughs> all right the next item I'm gonna try to get all this stuff off the bed would have been a dollar 95 what is it oh so this is something my mom wanted <laughs> I literally asked her and she picked out some like random stuff so I guess she's ordered this off of wish it's like the horse heel cream. 
comes like that. She said it's like not really a great value for the amount that you get, but if I could get it for free, then she would want some of it. I know that scent. It's like spearmint? Wintergreen. It's like wintergreen. Hmm. I mean, I doubt she'll mind if I take a little bit. I guess it's for your foot. Foot cream? I'm not showing my foot. It doesn't seem too magical to me. Now my hands are going to smell like that. If it starts to bother me, I'll go wash my hands. <laughs> okay. So got, got your cream, Mom. <laughs> All right. The next thing would have been $4.99. Yet again, free, free, free. I'm pretty sure I'll put up somewhere kind of like what the coupons look like. I really hope they do it again next year. Because I will say this is the first thing that Vova's done that I've been like super excited about since they had the under $1.99 session. Also, if you haven't downloaded the Vova app and you would like to, I'll put my link down in the description down below. And then you can go ahead and get to shopping. So, this is, I got two like mini backpacks. So, this is one of them. I'm guessing the thing's inside of it. It is. So, I was thinking on the cruise, I don't want to have like a purse purse. But there's some things you want to bring with you. But I was wondering if I would like... Okay, all you have to do is just take this thing and slide it like all the way so you get like them separated. And then you put it right through here. And then you have your two straps. And obviously you can make it any, like this might be, actually this would probably be good. I mean, it's not the most high quality like leather that you would ever seen. But it wasn't really bad of a bad price. And let's see the spaciousness of it. So it's pretty spacious. It's got that lining on the inside. And it even has like a little pocket on the side. And then you still have your front pocket. I think I got two, so I'm not sure if this is the bigger one or this is the smaller one. But I thought that these would come in handy. Because even, like, if you wanted to, if you, like, needed to access stuff, you could even, like, put it in the front, kind of get what you need, and then kind of put it on your back. And then I don't have to worry about where my purse is or setting it on the counter or something like that. So this is an option. Am I knowing for sure I'm going to wear this on the cruise? I don't know, but it's an option. I'm going to test it out by, like, putting stuff in it. Because I really don't need this much room for stuff. But it was hard to tell what the size was going to be. So that's why I got two. So I'm hoping this one either I could use another time. Like, even if I'm not using it on a cruise, it'll be super handy. But, I mean, the quality of the leather, like I said, isn't the best thing you've ever seen in your life. But it works. It'll work. All right, what do we got next? So this one was 81 cents. Okay, so this is 81 cents and it's a ring. I thought it was really, really pretty. I believe I got it in a size 9 because I thought that my middle finger was a size 9, but I think I possibly could have gotten an 8. But then I worry, like, if I would have gotten an 8 and I would have, like, swollen up, then it wouldn't fit. But that's kind of, kind of neat, huh? Let's see. Oh, no. I don't even know if I can get that on my middle finger. <laughs> Will it fit on this one? Ooh. So that's going to be... I swear to God, I got a nine, and the other nines that I got off Wish were, like, super duper big, and this one is, like, tight. Tight. But still pretty. <laughs> Let's see, can I put it on this finger? And then on my regular ring finger, it's, like, a little loose. I think I have, like, man hands. Like, I just have, like, larger fingers than some. Whatever. <laughs> so, I think it's very pretty. I like it. I will probably definitely wear this for 81 cents. Not bad. Actually, for free. Not bad at all. What are you doing, Paco? Sleeping. Alright, so this one was 94 cents. Like I said, something that I just literally threw in the cart just to get enough money to reach the $5. So this is the box. It is a toothbrush. <laughs> Even though I do still have a couple of the um, travel toothbrushes or little toothbrushes that I got off of Wish forever and a day ago, this one seemed a little neat. So, here's the toothbrush. Soft to medium bristles. But the bottom was neat. It's like thicker. What does that say? Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> but, I mean, it's a toothbrush. It was free. 
What was that? Something cents? <laughs> I mean, you can get a you can get like a two pack or a three pack at the Dollar Tree for a dollar, but I was looking for things, and it's cute. Maybe I'll bring this one on the cruise. I like the sturdiness of the handle. Different and nice, and I like it. All right, what's next? So this was four dollars and two cents. Oh, and then actually this has two items in it. Um, it came in another package, and so I just added it in here. This would have been $1.56. It's these perfume atomizers. If you guys haven't got one of these yet, I thoroughly recommend it. The only bad thing is, like, if you're not going to use the same perfume over and over again, it's hard to, like, get the old scent out of the, out of the one you already have. But for such cheap price, not really that big of a deal. So pretty much all you do is you just um, take the top off. And then, actually, sorry. You don't take the top off. You take the top off your other, I meant take the top off your other. Take your top off your other perfume and then just pump it until on the side you see that it's full and then you're ready to go. And you get a spritz away. They're handy dandy, come in a whole bunch of different colors and you have it right in your purse. Like who wants to carry a big bottle of perfume with them? You could have your favorite perfume on the go. If you don't have those little like travel size ones, like I have some travel size perfumes, but I also do have some big ones so this is like perfect. And you can have get different colors for different perfumes, whatever you want to do. But if you don't have one of those, I recommend it. And then the other one was the $4 and something cents. This is something my mom wanted. Only my mom wants like the randomest stuff. These are fridge door handle covers. Because you always thought to yourself, my, my, my fridge door just isn't soft enough for me to, <laughs> for me to hold on to. I need a little, I need a little extra something. But my mom loves stuff like this. This added little, like, perks or things. Like, she has so many of these little Christmas hats. Like, I'm talking the hats are like this big. She put them on everything. Everything in the house had a hat on it. She even gave me some for Christmas. So I guess I gotta, like, hat it up next year. But I'm not gonna put this on my fridge because they're for my mom. But, yes, they have. Fridge door handle covers. I would have never searched for that. I was wondering if my mom goes, can you find some do uh, fridge door handle covers? I was like, what? They make that? <laughs> they do. They even had like festive ones for like the holidays. But I got her one she could use like all year long. <laughs> we had a lot of stuff. All right, so this would have been or is five four fifty six. Now, I thought this was neat. I would never have bought this in any way, shape, or form. But I was thinking, like, if it worked out, we could frame it and hang it in the living room because we're looking for, like, new things that we can hang up that are kind of, like, lighter colored because we moved from the darker color stuff. So I showed it to Rob already, and he was like, wait a minute. How can I show this to you? So, like, the bottom, look, there's Antarctica. And there's Antarctica again. <laughs> so I'm guessing if you did it correctly and you didn't show that, like people wouldn't see the mishaps. But I will say the quality of this canvas is very nice. I still like it. <laughs> so, I mean, let's get up close. I mean, it's really good quality. I forgot what the size is. But it's a pretty decent size. I mean, if you were to frame that, that's a pretty decent size. I'm going to try to talk him into getting it framed and hanging it up, but we'll see. <laughs> but it does have that little bit of imperfection. Or you could even, like, take it out, like, trim it up to here and only just have just, like, this stuff out. And you wouldn't have to even worry about it. Even knowing Antarctica was even involved in the situation. <laughs> Feels really a lot. All right, so this was $1.17. Or is $1.17. It is, I believe, a necklace. I kind of forgot half the stuff I got. Let's not joke around. Oh. You know me. I was trying to find something that had an exact amount. And I found... Hold well, on, let me get this out of the way. It's a bee. Where's a cute bee? These are cute for kids or... If you like bees. What's the other thing? Oh. And then it says on this thing... 
focus. It says believe in yourself. That's cute. It does have the um, chain like this, the which you can remove if you want to. I know, guys, you can use pliers. I twisted them off before. Or you can put it on another chain, whatever you want to do. Here's the chain. Not super mega sturdy, but will do the job. But that's cute. I feel like I keep, like, pulling stuff out of here, but I'm not moving that much. So I got two of these on different orders. So I'm just going to pull them both out. They both were $2.89. I got these for Rob. With the thought that he could use them at work, like, for snacks and things. And then it will, like, take up less space. So it's supposed to be, like, a collapsible... Put your snacks in there and you put the i mean that's a nice top with the whole clip on top put your snacks in can i get it to close and then clip it on and then when you finish your snack oh can't close it when the top's on well that's good to know so at least if the top's on you don't have to worry about it collapsing on its own then boom collapse ready to go put the top back on And it saves a lot of room. So even like storing these in your cabinet won't take a lot of room up. I think that's really good, good, good quality. I love me some collapsible. I don't know why. Like I love space saving. And like compared to like if you would have had a regular Tupperware just that size, it would have been one would have just been that size. And even though you could have put them both into each other, it would have taken up probably like that much room compared to. Three. All right, let's grab another big one. So this was $3.89. Oh, here's the other backpack. So as I'm seeing this now, this one is the smaller one. <laughs> I, mean, I need to see if they have like a small, small one. But I probably don't have enough time to even... I probably don't have enough time to even get, get it in time for the cruise. But maybe for the next cruise. So here is the other one. This is definitely a better quality material. And it has already has connected adjustable straps. I mean, these will be good for any time. My sister, when she came to visit for Christmas, had a backpack. And I was like, that is pretty darn handy instead of having to carry a purse. Because it gets annoying. Like, I like those purses that are just kind of like in your armpit. And that, you know, that could get annoying trying to hold on to that. Hurts your shoulder sometimes, depending on where you got in there. Boom. I like this one. I don't hate the other one, but I like this one. This one's definitely going to have a lot of, a lot of room. Even if I was flying, like if you're going on the plane, I have a big, big backpack when I used to, when I was carrying like my laptop with me, but I really don't want to do that anymore because it's so heavy and it just kills me. So like this will be perfect to have everything you need. That's the big section. And second section. All nicely lined inside. And then there's a cute little extra little section. You could throw, like, especially if you're traveling, you could put your ID in here or anything like stuff like that. Because when you have to do like the boarding or whatever, that could be like easily accessible. Yeah. It almost seems like it has that material. Almost like a backpack material. Might even be like water resistant, waterproof. Yeah. The only thing is, like, I'm not a huge gold girl. So, like, both of these, like, this is a really, really, like, yellowy gold. But they both have, like, black and gold. I believe there might have been other colors you could choose from. I don't quite remember, but I believe there was. All right, let's grab another small one. A dollar five for this one. Like I said, <laughs> sometimes just trying to find things to fill the cart. So anything that kind of sparked my interest and looked kind of neat. I went ahead and just purchased. So, it's an ornament. This is supposed to like sit in here. Did it break already? Or does it just slide in? Oh, so it just slides in here. That could definitely fall out. And then you got a little ornament. It's like a 3D esque ornament. They had different ones you could pick from. This one was like the cheapest one in order to get it to be in my cart to get the exact amount that I needed. 
Well, that's nice. Of course, this is over, but I will put this right into the Christmas bin, and it'll be all ready for next year. And I'll be like, oh, remember I got that for free? All right, the next thing would have been $1.51. This is probably the one funny item. <laughs> I saw it. I laughed. I figured you guys would laugh. They had different, like, choices, I believe. Ooh, the smell of... The smell of rubber is abundant. The girl looks so funny in it. <laughs> oh my gosh, the rubber smell. But, I mean, you never know, this might be handy. What if Rob came home and I had this, like, on? He'd be like, what the hell is wrong with you, Melissa? <laughs> Stop buying all that stuff. And I'll be like, you know what? It was free, babe. So, you can't get mad. It's free. <laughs> all right, this next thing was 42 cents. This is one of the definitely the ones that I was literally just trying to get to the $5. And it's hard to find super duper cheap items. Like, super duper cheap. So, it's just a pin. <laughs> it's pretty, though. I thought it was pretty. So, it's literally just a pin. I have some pins stuck to my um, curtain in the bedroom, so I'll probably just stick that one in there too. It's pretty. There were different colors, but I think this is the cheapest one. I feel like I have something in my eye. Maybe not. Alright, I think we got some bigger ones. And then we're on to more smaller ones. I told you this would be a long video. 20 items is a lot of items. I'm trying to go as fast as I can, but we'll see how that goes. So this is, was $4.55. I literally got this because I wanted to know what the quality of these backdrops. I've seen them on Wish also. So I got... Well, this is going to be hard to show. So this is the backdrop. And it's just it's supposed to look like wood. I guess you can have it either way you wanted to. If you were wanting to be long ways, you could have it long ways. And then if you wanted to have it um, this way, you could have it this way. I mean, you tell me. Could you, if I was like standing in front of this, could you tell that it was fake? I mean, it doesn't look mega realistic. But if you were in a bind, like say you're a person who wants to film at home but doesn't have a good wall to use or doesn't have like a setup like this, like... Even though I needed a second bedroom and I, I needed to put a bed in here, like, would I have spent the money on this one if I wasn't going to be filming? Probably not. I probably got a basic, basic bed and not even thought twice about it. But because I was filming, I decided to elaborate a little bit more. Get a little more fancy. Which I love it. It's awesome. <laughs> but, I mean, this is something that if it's something that you need or you might or are thinking about needing... It could be something you purchase. I mean, for five dollars to get a backdrop for five bucks, that's not that bad. They are a lot more expensive on Wish, I believe. And this, I believe, was the cheapest one. But they had a lot of different options to, on this link to choose from. This one just seemed like it was going to be the most realistic looking. But you might not be looking for realistic. You might want to get something that just completely like off the wall where people know it's not real but who cares like it's, maybe that's your thing but it's this so this four dollars and seventy cents oh so i'm excited for this it's supposed to be either a four or a six piece travel set just like this i think it's six and this is the brand. This is the brand. I bought now a bunch of things from this brand and on Wish and Boba, and I've been thoroughly, thoroughly happy with it. Now, my luggage just broke on me after like 15 years. Like the thing just like the zipper just came completely off and I was like, okay, we've had a good run. So my dad for Christmas got me this new luggage set. Super awesome. First time having the four wheel luggage. I had no clue. I thought all the people were fancy that had the four wheels and just were walking around like pushing their luggage. Nope. They aren't even that expensive. All that time I was suffering with my crappy piece of luggage. So it came with this. So it comes with all these different things. Now I do have some already and I might still use those, but the new luggage piece of luggage I have, my old one used to have this like area that clipped on the side where I would put like my bras 
and my underwear and all that stuff. Well, this one doesn't have that. So I figured in order to, like, I can now separate everything. So first you got this big bag, which I have one already for shoes, which I'll probably use. And I have another one, I believe, too. This is a smaller one. But I figured if these were a whole big set and it was free, might as well. So this one says secret pouch. It says secret pouch this way and unzips this way. Is the Sun Tribe Travel. I mean, basic. This might be something that I could put my bras in. Obviously, I don't bring like that much crazy stuff. Then we got one this size. This is my hand so you can kind of see like what it is. This, I might be able to put my underwear in that one. Actually, this is pretty nice for the price. Or something. And then you get this one. That's vented. You get a smaller one. More like a box shape. That's also vented. And it has a handle. Not bad. And then you get a kind of tiny little one. So I ordered something else off of Wish for like our cords, which hopefully it comes in time and I can haul it and then it works with worse. Even if it comes and I don't get a chance to do the video, I'm still going to take it with us and then I'll just review it when I get back. But that's a lot of bags. I can't remember how much I paid for the ones that like the shoe one. I think I paid like a couple dollars for the shoe one alone. So to get six bags, Getting a little crazy over here. I right, let's go on a couple more of these small ones. So yet again, all free. This three dollars and ninety cents. Oh, this is another one for my dad. This I thought was neat because it's a wood-looking watch. That looks pretty small. You may have to. You have to figure something out with that. So. I wonder if this is a woman's watch. They had it on a man's. They just had it out, so I don't know if it is a woman's watch. It might be a woman's watch. We all know. Now I'm thinking with all these, like the way this looks, that this is a woman's watch. Dang it. I mean, I could try to give them to anyway. But it's, it's definitely like a plasticky type, but it's like a wood fake looking. There's different types of grains you could pick from. I think it's for a woman because <laughs> it's definitely like not big like usually I think he has to take links out I mean this is big on me we'll just hope that like he doesn't see this video when I give it to him and I'll be like I got your watch and if he goes immediately like I think it's a woman's watch Melissa then I'll be like okay fine <laughs> my mom doesn't wear watches Maybe, maybe she will for, for just this. Be like, hey mom, I got you, I got your watch. Can I get it to close? That's the question. Alright, got it to close. But, there it is. Might be for a man, might be for a woman. <laughs> Alright, one more big one, and I think everything else is going to be smaller. It's 347. Oh, another thing my mom wanted. Their meat thermometer that they have does not give them like accurate readings, which who knows is just going to give accurate readings. But instead of getting like there was different ones and instead of getting the one that was like the cheapest, I went like a step up. So I'm hoping that will mean something. Comes with instructions. I wonder what it takes for batteries. But the batteries are right in. One better. One LPLR44. Oh yeah, came on. Looks like it's set to Celsius. Boom, Fahrenheit. There we go. Is it 63 degrees in here? Might be. It's a little chilly. <laughs> but she'll be happy with that. Hopefully it works for her. I will not, I'm not going to literally put it in some meat and like check it out. Let me turn it off. But comes with instructions. Comes in a nice little carrying case. It's gonna be fun when I go over their house. But like usually they always like try to they're always like giving me stuff. Now I got lots of stuff to give you. Can I get it back in the thing? I will do it later. 
little crazy over here. I'm trying to get like all the bags off the bed. This says 54 cents. Ooh. So I have a white one, exactly the same thing as this on my car right now. Now the goal is that I'm getting a new car this year, hopefully. And I just love my little Chihuahua with like a heartbeat thing. And this one was silver and I thought this would be great because my next car, I'm planning on getting silver. My car right now is gray. And I realized after now having it for 10 years that gray gets dirty. In Florida with the pollen, gray gets dirty. But silver usually is like the one color of car that you can have like not be like super dusty. It doesn't look as dusty. It could be dirty and you wouldn't really know about it. So I'm super excited. This will be going on my next car. I love it. Nobody's ever like given me any confidence on it or anything like that, but I love it. And when I see it, when I walk with my car, I'm like, oh. <laughs> All right, this 96 cents. I think I accidentally got two of these. I don't know if they're both in here, if they both showed up. But I, yet again, trying to get something exactly the right amount of money. You can make mistakes. All right, so this is a multi necklace with some gems on it. That one I got off of Miss A, I wore it on New Year's Eve, that multi layer necklace. And then when I took it off, the clasp broke. It's kind of sad because I, I did get a compliment on it. It does have the adjustable thing right here. But that's what it looks like. Dainty. I mean, the chain's all right. Obviously, this is the chain you're going to have to work with because everything is connected. But I like how dainty it is. There's a chance I'll wear that. Not mess that up. All right, this, $1.30. This is also for my mom. Also a thing she picked. I actually saw this in her bathroom. Snail eye cream. Supposedly snail stuff is good. It's snail essence. She won't mind if I take a little out. So it looks like this. I mean, it's pretty thick and creamy. It has that like clean, fresh scent. I mean, there's probably nothing wrong with it. I mean, this is a pretty decent size. 20 grams. 0.71 ounces. What was that? Was that 96 cents? No, it wasn't 96 cents. Whatever I said it was. But she likes this, so I got it for her. There you go, Mom. They're getting hooked up this time. All right, this one was 43 cents. I also got this in a size 9, so I got this for myself. I usually get ones for my dad in a size 11. So we'll see if this size 9 fits my finger. It looks like this, and boom. That's pretty, huh? Different. And they go all the way around. Snoring. Rough life taco. Now see, this one, size 9, fits a lot better. Where the other one I tried on was a lot more um, snug. This one fits pretty good. On both fingers. So I like that. That's really pretty. I can see myself wearing something like that. You are snoring, Paco. Am I boring you? All right, so the next one is 96 cents. Another thing my mom wanted. It is just one silver metal straw. She wanted it to be bent. It comes with a brush. I have some of these. I don't tend to use them that much, but I do have them. Like, usually if I drink it at home, I drink it from my big cup. And these things are not long enough for it, but they are handy. And if you drink something that's cold, it actually, like, the metal will cool your lips. So it's kind of refreshing. One more left. Three more, guys. Three more. You guys made it. All right, so this one was $2.07. I also got this for Rob. It's a travel silverware set. So it comes in a thing like this. There were different colors you could choose from. Slides open. And it's legitimately real silverware. <laughs> wow. Stainless steel, it says. Boom. Real stainless steel silverware. And it came with a fork and a spoon. These are actually pretty darn sturdy. <laughs> These might even be more sturdy and nice, nicer than like the ones I have downstairs. 
but you get two. Wow. I think the only thing it didn't come with was, would be like a knife. I don't know if I have a knife that'll fit in here. He can, he can make it work. And then it just slides right on. I did something wrong here. I think it's supposed to be opposite way. But then boom. Brings it home. I clean it. Whatever. Put it back in his, in his lunch bag. They also had ones that were like that came with plastic silverware. Some even came with plastic silverware and chopsticks. But I asked him which one he wanted and he preferred this one. So that's the one I got. Two more. Are we going to end up with a bang? I'm almost like realizing what these things are as we go. This $1.73. Ooh. So I got a passport holder. So I just renewed my passport. And usually for the cruises when we go to the Bahamas, you don't need your passport. All you need is your birth certificate. My birth certificate is like this big. So it always makes me worried bringing that out. So I thought this was neat. You can put your little, your passport in here. And have a little passport book. I mean, I see nothing wrong with that. So I think I would be putting my passport right in this. It'll keep it nicer, longer. Not like I ever leave the house besides for going on a cruise. I guess I could use it when I go, when I travel on the plane too, I could use it. But if I'm going to Rhode Island, like, do I really need my passport? This is just a little bit more like sturdy. Easier for me to lose that little piece of paper than for me to lose this. So I'll be putting my passport in that. Now for the final item, guys. Final finale. 96 cents. Oh, we're not we're not ending on a <laughs> on a high note. <laughs> we're ending on literally the same exact necklace. I told you I accidentally bought two of them. So now at least if I really, really like that necklace, now I have a backup one. So bonus, I guess. So like I said before, if you made it through this whole entire video, it was pretty neat they did this whole like free thing. I mean, if they do this again next year, I mean, they must have lost a lot of money. Like, how much money do they really think that 300 of them every hour on the hour for multiple days, every hour on the hour, that's a lot of money they lost. Maybe that's why, because it was supposed to go all the way through on Monday, all the way through like 5 o'clock, 5 p.m., and it stopped at like 11 a.m. I think they, and it like started glitching, and I was like, they're probably like, oh my gosh, what do we do? This is the worst idea ever. But I thank you for it. I wish I would have claimed more, like, I wish I would have figured out the system, but now I got the system down pat. Just like it the Daily Wish giveaway, it took me a while to figure it all out. So it took me a little while to figure this out. But if they do it again, I got this. So like I said before, this is also a collab with Becca on a budget, my friend Becca. So after you're done with this, hop on over to her channel. I'll put the link down below, and then you can see the stuff that she got during the Black Friday vova a -thon. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or any questions, please put them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you haven't yet subscribed and would like to, feel free. I would be very happy if you did. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye.